Remember, but I'm just gonna put her in a fast mold. She's, there we go. Were you pushing down on her that time? No, I was more uh, manipulating her back to go down, kind of like a beach chair. Good girl, Tina. Yes. Okay. So yeah. So when I when I do this fast, or I want you to do it slow. It's just if you think of kind of like a beach chair. I never got it. It's kind of hard to explain. But if you kind of just like go this, and it's kind of like a folding thing. So not don't wait down. for her to start to sit. Well, yeah. This is just a tad bit faster. But don't push down. Still don't push, push down. down. It's more like a folding. So you're using your right hand to sort of pull up and right. your left hand to right. pull, okay. But that's not how I want you to do the molded sets. This will just get us going for the, right. this. Plus you, you can do, <laughs> yeah, I was that's all right. Oh, oh you, you pulled her out. Okay. <laughs> so pull up these. There you go. And try to stand, yeah, and then just do it again. Wow. So don't tug on the leash. Count to 10 in your head. And then when you get her there, say, Yes. Oh. <laughs> she came she out beat of, me a little bit. She came out of it a little bit. Oh, did you hear the music? Yes, I sure did. Did you get replacements or no. that's the old cartilage, huh? Click them together. I so, know so many people now who've had knee replacements. That's what I want to avoid. Luckily, my knees seem okay. <laughs> there we go. There we go. Keep your hand closer on the chain. There you go. Now slide down. And then think of folding a beach chair. There you go. Nope. Yep. yep. So just start all over. And tell her good girl when she sits down. Or you can. Yeah. There's no reason not to. So you had it better before. I think your hand's too far down there. Like so. There you go. Yeah, and nonchalantly stand up and don't tug on the leash. I like that innocent look right there. She's like, what? Am I supposed to be doing something else? Don't tug on that leash yet. <laughs>
Yes, good girl. There you go. Good girl. <coughs> You're going to kill me, Robin, before you kill the dog. I'm sorry. I'm no, so sorry. Right. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm taking it you have a bad back as well. Yes. yes. I, I think I heard the, oh, the no. cracking there, yes. too. Yes. Huh? So, the back is more. If I was more diligent with stretching, I would be okay. Hopefully the treats at home will keep you from having to do the back too, too much. And again, you can start her on a table. Just make sure you have something on there that is grippy so she's not sliding. Oh, oh, you missed her. Take your eyes off of me. You might not get to a minute this week, and that's fine. So what you want to see happen is uh, be able to get four of whatever time you're working on in a row. Well, that's the goal. Yes. Good. So girl. you might get to like 20 seconds or 30 seconds. That'll be fine. Okay. Good girl. But four in a row of them is the important part. Okay. At the end of the week. <laughs> I mean, it took... Luckily, Tina doesn't have any hip or leg problems. Not yet. <laughs> she feels still feels spry. She's a heel of Tara. Not down here. It's probably the driveway next door. Yeah. Uh, right on the other side of the fence is like a 200 foot driveway. That's our neighbor's uh, This will be easier when we get to the corrections too for the set. So the corrections are what get you upright. Yes, good girl, good girl. We all like to be upright when we're handling our dogs. Because you can, I get so sore when I'm doing a small dog on these things. Yeah, yeah. yeah I'll be ready for every program. <laughs> <laughs> Don't forget to say sit though, otherwise she's not in the command, so. At home. So even after you push her down, you say sit? At, on this exercise, I will just remind her what she's doing. But on the, the molded sits, I don't say anything at first. Yes, good girl. Good girl. Let me try again. <laughs> <laughs> you so as you push her down, you say sit. Or not push her down, but as you guide her. Right, yeah. You say sit. But she's somewhat familiar with yeah. it. She knows I might say it before. You could probably say it beforehand, too. On this one exercise. So we say sit. Yep. So you can say sit now if you haven't said it. Sit. There you go. It'll probably speed things along. Yes, good girl. Good girl. I know I'm not usually teaching these two at the same time, but you need the stay more than you need the long line, which I would normally be doing. Actually, I usually do the long line the first lesson, oh. but that's not really your problem right now. <laughs> Sit. And we can always add it in. If, if, 
or like healing so she heals back from the beach instead of pulling you along that's part of the long line but we have plenty of time to do it this is still just lesson two You're getting bald. She likes to chase them too. Even Six. Don't pull up. Sorry. I know. Oh, you're right. <laughs> yeah, you don't want to pull her out of the stay. Sit. Sit. So you you can just say it the one time though, and then. Okay. So if she gets up, then do I just, just rub, yep. rub her back? And yep. Unless she does it for you, and then you can say, oh, good girl. Sit. Good girl. <laughs> oh, good girl means I can move. That's why Y-E-S means. So, the, and the reason why we do that is when later on when we're doing stays, you might see her start to get distracted in the middle of it, and you want to say good girl so to encourage her to keep going. So I teach them early on that that good girl does not mean release. Gotcha. Yes. Good girl. Yeah, that's a good girl. Good girl. Good girl. See, this isn't that bad, is it? <laughs> You're trying to convince her with English words? <laughs> For me than it is for you. If only that worked, huh? I was like, boy, life would be simpler if we could just talk to our dogs. Yep. Say, listen, no one wants to hear you bark at them. <laughs> there you go. So say good sit or something like that. Good sit. Oh. Sit. There you go. Sit. Yes, good girl. Do we do it after she sits? Do you do what? Oh. When you use the kibble, when to. Like, yeah. To so sit. right. So I'll I'll uh, right. Once she sits, she can then I'll give it to her. But when I do the stays, I usually do it after like the ten seconds. Okay. 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 So then, so because we're starting really small, so. Tiny seconds or even five seconds. Give her the kibble. Yes. Okay. Then usually they catch on if they're used to being treated. Like, okay, I'm going to get treated I'm every time I do this. It's like me. <laughs> Lisi motivates me with fear. Again, or are we? I think you're good. Okay. I think will that give you enough homework for the. Uh... Oh, I don't know. You don't know? What do you think?